Joining us now, Louisiana Senator John Kennedy. You know, they, they pointed out your state senator, and I liked the fact that they figured it out early. They got on board fast, and they were able to drop, level it much faster than other places, I would argue, because we learned a lot by the time you got the, by the time Louisiana got hot. We did learn a lot. We also benefited from the, uh, uh, the president's assistance. We got extra PPE. Uh, we, uh, we, he uh, was going to build us an extra hospital. We didn't need it. Uh, we never came close to running out of ventilators, uh, thanks to the uh, president and, and the vice president. Our numbers are now going in the right direction. And we are starting to talk about reopening the economy. I was very impressed today with the uh, the Trump, Fauci, Burks plan for reopening the economy. I, I think heard, it will work. I hope yep. the governors follow it. Is it true? Did Drew Brees donate like five million dollars to Louisiana or something like that? Uh, a crazy amount he of did. money, right? He did. It, Pretty he amazing did. guy. Uh, Drew Good B. For him. He is. He's a, he's a wonderful football player, but he's a he's an even better person, and he's been very generous with his money. Uh, but a lot of people in, in in and outside of Louisiana have been very generous to the people of Louisiana, right, let me ask including you this. and especially the American taxpayer. And I, okay. I want to thank the American taxpayer because it's their money that we're spending. Well, as long as it's for workers displaced and hospital supplies and ventilators and thermometers and testing and also small business and big business through no fault of their own impact, and I'm fine with it. I think we're going to get into a fight, though, with your Democratic colleagues because they're going to want to balance these corrupt budgets of uh, these you know, states by burdening the taxpayers. No money. These money's now going forward. No more art centers. No more humanities. No more endowments. They all got to go towards specific causes. Can we do that and pass clean bills, sir? We can if Speaker Pelosi will agree to it. Based on the conference call we had with the president this morning, on which uh, Democratic senators. Uh, to which they were invited. I worry we're going to have another fight, though. I, I, I worry that some of them are not going to support the uh, Trump, Fauci, Burks plan for reopening the economy. I hope I'm wrong. I know that the tofu and arugula crowd are not going to like the president's plan. They think that we should leave the economy shut down until th there is no more coronavirus. Yeah, okay. uh, that's wholly that ain't unrealistic for two reasons. No, that's unrealistic. The, uh, that's, that's, it's bone deep down to the marrow stupid for two reasons. Number one, the economy will collapse. The world economy will collapse if ours does. And number two, as we saw in Michigan, the uh, American people are not going to stand for it. Senator, we wish the people of your great state the best. Send our best to Drew B Breeze. He's a great guy. Uh, it has to open. Yes. 